Okay, we're gonna take a ridiculous ride in a rat vet. <laughs> Actually, they built this truck on purpose, and you're gonna laugh about it once we start showing you some more pictures. Oh yeah. But it's a 1966 Chevy C20 pickup that's been shortened up to sit on a complete 2001 Corvette chassis. Yeah, it's like a Corvette, all right. LS powered, all Corvette underneath, frame, suspension, brakes, uh, even catalytic converters and exhaust, um, and the dash. But pretty cool, cool truck. It's got, you know, the big brakes, and it's, it's a handful if you put your foot in it. It's yeah, really, it won't let me. It's really light. I told Gary I don't want to die today, especially in a metal beer can. <laughs> but you know somebody's gonna love this thing oh, you got yeah. all this Good wiring luck. harness and computers and no airbags thank goodness just a couple wind bags a lot of warning lights on the dash like the active suspension and the airbags and the in the traction control yeah, none right. of that stuff is gonna work on this truck we don't want traction control no nah, we don't need no traction we need less traction but surprisingly it's smooth it don't rattle that much and you got air leaking from everywhere and I'm sure it doesn't hold water out but the whole idea is to cruise this thing around and have people look at it and give you the thumbs up or or you're an idiot or whatever it's fun though <laughs> it's really fun I'm telling you I dig this thing it's like five inches off the ground yeah they, and it's not lower they actually cut the body and laid it, it over the frame yeah. they channeled it so it rides like a regular Corvette not bouncy or anything like that Pretty cool. And it's a canvas. You can do whatever you want. You can change some stuff on it. I mean, the second I saw it, I'm like, oh, I would change the lights and I would do this and I would, you know, put some bumpers on it. But we'll leave that up to the next guy. Or you might leave it alone. But it's a six speed. Woo! Holy smokes. Just like a bat. I should have brought my helmet, especially yeah. when this guy pulls in front of us. Yeah, okay. There. There, here's our picture spot. Okay. Here's the rat vet. That's what she looks like on the outside. It's Corvette underneath and an old beat up Chevy pickup truck. The short bus on top. So it was a C20 originally. They shortened up that bed. I said, where are we going to put the exhaust? I said, well, let's cut the tailgate. Let's put some trailer lights on it. I'm going to get a new fence, so might as well use the old gate for the back lid. <laughs> That's pretty crazy, but it is cool it's fun to drive it gets lots of attention it's something that if you wanted to like mint the body out and do something cool with some fender flares like a Jim Connor kind of thing I mean you could do a lot with this truck if you wanted to or you leave it alone it's got personality got some dings and dongs and dents but the doors close it's channeled right down over the top of the Corvette frame what it is show you in here here's your rear differential for the Corvette exhaust everything coming out the back pretty cool the cops are coming to get us don't let them see this <laughs> no kidding fun project all right, here's the power plant in the 66 Chevy C20 Rat Vet. Just a stock LS1 5.7 liter Corvette engine. It's got a cold air intake. That must give it a few more horsepower. And a little weight reduction, probably. Pretty neat. They got this welded up so you can open the hood up and just tw twist it forward and close it. It won't blow open on you or anything like that. We'll go ahead and fire this one up for you. Nothing special to hear here. Just a Corvette. <laughs> Not bad. It sounds good though. The exhaust coming out the tailgate back here. Quad tip. <laughs> that's, that's pretty cool, man. Well, if you want to see this one in person, come on out. Just to, even if you want to just come take a look. We're out here in uh, California Cars. We're 2158 Union Place in the city of Simi Valley, California. Phone number here is 818-591-1313. You can speak to myself, Rich, or Gary, and we'll be happy to show you around.
Thanks for watching.